Hey, Joe here. Have you ever had an oil pressure sending unit that is screwed directly into your engine fail? I have. They don't like all that vibration. So today, I will be remote mounting some pressure senders for reliability and longevity. I started by ordering a bunch of 3AN fittings. Some good thread tape. Some pre-assembled AN lines. Various pressure sensors. and this billet sensor bracket. After I got everything out of its packaging, I started getting the threads taped up. You can see here the method I use to apply the tape. The tape should be on the threads only, not in any orifice of the fitting. And it should be wrapped in this direction so the tape doesn't come off during assembly. After all the fittings and sensors are prepped, I assemble the sensor bracket that will hold the MAP sensor, coolant pressure sensor, and exhaust back pressure sensor. I bought a good map sensor because it's important, but I'm using some cheap sensors for EMAP and coolant pressure for now. I got the bracket mounted where I wanted it
and then installed the 8th inch NPT to 3AN fittings where I needed them. I routed the oil pressure feed line along with the crank angle sensor wiring away from any moving parts. I then began routing the other 3AN feed lines for the MAP sensor and coolant pressure sensor. The oil pressure sender will be mounted in a cushion clamp next to the billet bracket. Next up was to install the fitting in the EMAP canister that is already fed from the EGR port to connect the 3AN line to it. No. No, no, no. <sighs> so that dash three stainless braided line, it's not long enough, so I'm gonna have to get a new one on its way. A couple other little odds and ends I needed, so I just plan on getting out stuff all on its way, and in the meantime, that'll be it for today. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, subscribe, all that stuff, you know, YouTubers tell you to do. Um, I appreciate you guys watching. And, uh, you know, if you watched, you haven't subscribed, you gotta hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, so that you'll know next time I release a video. And uh, you can keep up with what's going on with this beast right here. So, talk to you later. Put cheese on it. <laughs>